Okay, I think I'm recording now. These steps are okay when I'm expecting it. Not finding much trash out here as I did before. There is some trash. I'm saying there's always trash out here. People around me are total pigs. And this furniture is difficult for me to get around. Sometimes kids are running up and down these walkways. I'm going to walk over here a little bit. I realized recently I've been saying the wrong thing. What I have is low vision. I can see something, but everything I see is a blur. Until the cataracts are corrected, everything's going to be a blur to me. I have repeatedly mentioned the lack of a handrail going down this stairwell. Aaron will just say, we're working on it, we're working on it. Yeah, well, even normal people are going to have trouble with no handrail. Somebody who's dealing with low vision should have something to hold on to while going up and down stairs. I'm going to go up and down these stairwells just to show what bad shape they're in. Now this was put in for somebody that needed a wheelchair. Once it's in, they tend to stay. It's not really a problem for me. The furniture at the end would be if I go that way, but I don't. So it doesn't matter to me, but this trash kind of does. About once a year, they will paint these stairwells. But see how bad this paint is, it's just coming off. As I go up, you should be able to see how some wood is broken or missing. And they've had three years to replace this missing or broken wood. Um, if they have, I'm not aware of it. I can see something, but everything I see is wrong. Okay, they did fix some of this wood, okay. Because there was broken wood in here. I don't see it. So I guess they fixed this area. Because the missed broken wood seems to have been fixed. Or maybe it was in a different stairwell. I don't remember. I used to go this way all the time when I lived on this floor. I'm going to go down the other stairwell on the other side of the pool there because I think that had broken wood. I want to check to see if they fixed it. I don't know why this is out here. I don't normally walk up and down this way because I no longer live on this floor. But they're not supposed to be leaving stuff like that out all the time. Now the guy that lives in the corner here, 305, named Mark, he's helped me a few times. Good guy, unfortunately a smoker, so this area stinks. I wanted one of these end units, like this was not available when I moved into this complex. If it had been, I might have gotten this unit. And I'm not sure what that is. It looks like somebody leaves their uh, cigarette butts in a plastic jug full of water, which is okay. The wind won't scatter it, but it's still a little gross. I was given a chance to move it in this apartment. I decided I wanted to be on the top floor. If I had moved in this apartment, the guy living in 205 at the time would have been a problem. He would have been actually forced to move out. Again, on the end like that, it's not blocking anybody. It's not a problem. It's when they block the middle of the walkway can be a problem. Okay. There was broken wood in here. Looks like they finally fixed it. But, as it should show, it needs to be repainted. Yeah, they did fix on the broken wood. All right. I'm going to go to the one more stairwell. Give it a try. And see if it has been fixed. 
So it looks like some of my complaints have been addressed. I guess that was. The stairwell needs to be repainted. But the good news is I'm not seeing the missing wood like I did a year ago. It just needs to be repainted. But it looks like all the broken wood. Those lights, that one, which sometimes works, sometimes not. That can and not for smokers. It's just for trash when people put the junk mail in there. And a dog walked out. This guy here. They will open this pool up. Uh, Memorial Day weekend, like the end of May. Here in Colorado Springs, that's still a little cold. But right now, nobody <laughs> in the right mind would use the pool. It's a little cold here. Yeah. Now, most people park the right way. They don't pull in. If they do back in, they can be towed. I don't know if they actually enforce that rule. Now, see this satellite? You're not allowed to attach anything like that to the building, but you can have it on a freestanding pole like they do. Um, this side, I'm actually going to walk around the buildings so you can kind of see what's on the back side. This motorcycle, I believe someone wanted to mark. I've heard this motorcycle on one of them starting up. I've lived in places they do not allow motorcycles because they're too loud. Uh, where I'm at, I don't see any missing wood. Just bad need of paint. So I'm not going to go up that stairwell. I don't see any missing wood from this level. It looks like they did replace some of the broken wood. The neighbor I had on the third floor was complaining about getting splinters. If they repaint these stairwells when it's warm enough, this would be okay. But yeah, these can get slippery, which is why I had to move down from the third floor. And see all this trash? This is a constant problem around here. Just the trash. This car, see how that window is? The guy that used to take me to the store twice a month drives this car, and he never fixed that window. I don't know how we can see what's coming from the right. I don't feel safe riding with him until that car is actually fixed. I'm gonna go along. Look, some people will plant things out back like here. That's okay. They can keep up with it. More trash. The guy was here Saturday, I had to go back this way. I pulled the AC out of my window, but I'm gonna walk this way to where the AC used to be, just to show was like back here. Why well, so difficult to properly mount an air conditioner in the back windows? I don't want to plant that far away from where I live. Too hard to get back here and keep them up. Occasionally they'll get back here with a weed whacker. Okay. I'm not sure what these cables are. But if memory serves me correctly, this is not my place. It's a little further over. I think this is mine. If I remember right, this is mine. Yeah, there it is. The rocks. This is mine. This is my place. There's trash out here. These rocks are what was holding it back into my air conditioner up. That's not safe, so I'm gonna just shove it in and pull the AC out of here because the wind was blowing around it and I'm freezing. Even getting a little bit of snow in here. These rocks, come on. It's difficult put a shelf under this window with the trash back here. I'm just going to keep on going this way and see how this window is falling apart. Why did anybody put up with that? Maintenance here is horrible. Some people will take their dogs back here and walk them. And that's fine as long as I'm not stepping or anything. I don't know what that is, but I don't think it belongs there. There's a tree stump up here, so I have to be careful going around that. During the winter, this restaurant, La Baguette, was served some pretty good food. What I meant to say was that these lights on look pretty 
when it's winter and there's snow on the ground and I would put colored lights up here and kind of see where what's left of them is in that tree. I'm going to go this way. This is okay because I'm wearing my steel toe boots. I have enough foot protection and ankle support to do this. I know the ground is uneven and I'm mentally prepared for it and I have the right shoes on. I don't have much of a problem with it. It's when I'm forced to go off the sidewalk when I'm not expecting to, I have problems. It's getting cold out here. But the good news is they actually did replace some of that broken wood. But now it's just a matter of repainting the stairwell. I'm going to take the long way around. Rebecca's furniture there, still blocking my way. It's safer to take the long way and try to scoot around her stuff. And I don't like the fact she stands out there smoking. Yeah, she needs a, you know, get her nicotine fix. I just wish she'd be current enough, kind enough, and courteous enough to move away from the building when she smokes. So I don't have to keep breathing her garbage. The guy that lives in this corner unit will stand up by his mailboxes smoking. A nice guy, he's helped me a few times, so I do want to talk to him. I just do not want to breathe the cigarette smoke. And nobody's catching on to that. I do not want to breathe smoke. I have respiratory problems. I can't be breathing cigarette smoke without having problems. I need clean air. And that seems to be asking for too much in this dump. So you decide whether or not you would live here. When I can afford to, I'm getting out of the slum. The place is noisy. At least one of the neighbors is an idiot. Now, I can take this path. I'm wearing my boots. It's not a problem. I would prefer to stay on the sidewalk when I'm wearing sandals or moccasins. You still to the boots. I bought them so I could walk on an even ground, go up in the mountains and take a long walk. Although I can kind of see where there's this drop here. It's easier for me just to hold on to this post when I'm going up and down, so I know exactly where the edge is. And can keep my balance. Whew. I think one of my neighbors is smoking pot. I'm smelling something kind of foul. I'm going to turn the recorder off and leave it off until I have something more interesting to record. Bye.